Okay. So what we're going to do here is we're going to make an attempt to get a good opening for Castelton. Uh, first five turns, maybe seven or eight turns, we're going to try and get Azazel knocked out. And then keep that as a save file people can use. So let's get started on that. We're on uh, Legendary, very hard, uh, Crisis mode. I'm not big on crisis, let's move that up. 180, 150, yeah, that'll do. So again, the goal here is just to have a good, nice open. I know a lot of people who want to play the game, you struggle with that opening, you're worried it's going to be perfect or not. This probably isn't going to be perfect. It's just going to be done well enough that we can have a good solid start. I also have a couple of good leaders already saved. So we're going to get Gostelton, um, an Ice Witch imported right at the beginning. We're not going to rush, rush. We're going to uh, just build up to overwhelming force to knock out uh, the Ongol. I think that's who we're fighting at the beginning we have to fight them for a few battles it's unfortunate but we're doing it when we don't really have a lot of followers or supporters anyway so it won't hurt us that much the, t the idea would be to fight them early when you don't have those points so that they're not cancelling what you might have we're also not going to spend on a um I can't remember what they're called uh the area effect. Here we go. I'll rem would help if I knew what I was talking about, right? We're not going to spend on invocations at the beginning because we're going to use all of this to build our devotion buildings because we want to build devotion and we want to build the ability to uh, get patriarchs. Let me see if my audio from the desktop is... Let's turn that down a little bit. There we go. Okay. So, yeah, we're at war with these guys already. We're going to beat him down with Gustalton and this guy. We're going to upgrade this. This is only a thousand now. It used to be four thousand. That's definitely getting upgraded. We don't. We're going to get some of those Cossars with spears at the beginning. Uh, we want to get the devotion building. And then we're going to turn, that's going to get us some growth. We'll turn that into money or growth. I'm not sure which one I'll do at this point. What's Igor got on him? Corruption in the local province. I'm not particularly care about that. Let's get this down a little bit. Yeah, it's a bit loud in my headset there. Okay, so let's get him in the army. Okay, now we want to get uh, a Maiden, so we're going to hit him, then because they won't be able to recruit there, we're going to stop here and recruit a couple of guys. We're going to set this to Recruit. There it is. Uh, we're going to get a Frost Maiden. We get one, we don't have any, but I have saved characters, and we're going to get the one. Missile Strength. For Ice Guard. Uh, uh, where's the one that I want? It's the growth one. Where is she? Here she is. Don't you love this? We don't have the right uh, growth. Stalk. Weapon strength. There we go. That's all we want. That, she'll add a little growth while we're walking around. Now she's uh, Tempest. Um, we actually really also would like to get um, Ice. Uh, because ice is going to permit us um, to use um, Heart of Winter later on. As soon as we get a, a more capacity, we'll bother with that. But she's going to be our, she's going to allow us to use uh, the light of truth. I like Biting Wind, uh, and then I like uh, Hawks of Mishka. So no, probably not as good for us as the other, but we'll take it. Uh, because she's got growth 
and she stalks so she can sneak up on defenders and hit him a couple of times. Okay, so let's go. We'll build up our winds of magic, even though we're not using any right now. Okay, now this is gonna mean we take way too much damage, we don't want to take damage. Look at that kills our kills our archers. That's just BS. We're gonna use our ranged cavalry and our we're gonna use these guys here to draw the enemy and split them up. We've got better range here than everybody but him. Uh, this guy's gonna be a problem, but we should be able to use all of this to harass. Wipe this one out, wipe this one out, and then those guys, we can get some good damage in. We'll use this terrain, we'll get behind this terrain right here, so they have to come across this altar to hit us. Try and get them to come across it. But we want them to come all the way across it, so we're going to stand way far back. Three, four, five. Okay. Okay, so here we go. Just get this whole thing out here. Yeah, he should send his cavalry after us. We'd like them to do that because. Oh, he's sending him back the other way. Yeah, a Pyrrhic where we lose them. I mean, these would be the last units we would lose because we would never let them get into melee combat unless the enemy was down to nothing and we had all our ammo gone. So these guys, range 140. them over into there. Get in there and hide. Getting some good damage in on these guys. It's good. Now what we'll want to do if we can get them to separate a little is take the chariots and run them straight up on the Khazar infantry. Okay, get out of there. Again, the idea is to harass. If they'll stand still, we'll run right through them. If they're dumb enough to stand there. Oh, this is going to hurt. Everybody back. Everybody back. If they're going to charge us with these idiots. Yeah, this is great. They're getting totally separated from one another. Get those annihilated. Let's get everybody over here. We want to uh, take pot shots at them. Oh, armored cossars. Interesting. Okay. Okay, let's get over to here. What's that? 
That's the Casa Dervishes. Okay, so now we should be able to pour fire into these guys. Who's that? Okay, so the sleds, you're gonna go straight in. Rather not fight their leader. Okay, what's going on over here? Wow, those guys really did a number on our cavalry. Okay, let's have everybody step back a bit. Get out of there. Okay. Time to get some... Get out of there. Okay. Everybody get a couple extra kills. Lost no units. Okay. I shouldn't have sent that cavalry in. Uh, we only lost 43 units. It's not bad. It was mostly in here, and he took a beating. These are the guys we're actually going to get rid of first. Uh, we can do the same thing that they do with these guys once they're out of ammo. But they do serve a purpose of chasing people down, drawing people away, so they're useful now. They just cavalry, cycle charging cavalry is too much more too much micro for me. I don't really want to do it. So lots of experience. All these guys are killed. I think you get experience based on a disc kill number here. So, you know. He did his job. He kept their leader off of our guys. I mean, they got plenty of kills. And many, look at these kills. Look, like he'll be fully healed up because he lost no units. So we lose this now while we don't really have any to gain. We're going to take the... Uh, yeah, we don't really need that money. Let's take the replenishment. Okay, so we're in foreign territory there. So let's come back to here. Let's go as in camp, help us any. This is uh, four turns to replenishment. Still four turns. So we might as well do. Uh, Ambush for the experience. Root Marcher. We want to get this healing here. Okay, so she's ready to go. And then next turn, we're going to want to recruit from here and from here. So we're going to put 
uh, this ice witch I have, who also happens to increase the number of patriarchs we have. And she will no she can't. She can oh, we want oh, yeah, we want him to do the recruiting actually, because he's going to hit Andrew. So. Okay, and then she can recruit. Let's see. I deserve yeah, we don't wanna we don't wanna spend on that. Fools may not say. Okay. Let's get this one now. So either this one here to get the uh, range and the reload time up, or we start with this one for growth and casualty replenishment, or this one for casualty replenishment and growth. Uh, we want this one first. That's all I'm going to take. The Brotherhood will be out soon. They'll want to make deals with us, so we'll do it for the money. If we're quick enough, we can actually save them and use them as a buffer. So that's why we want to get race this and get Azazel killed, because then that takes all the pressure off the Brotherhood. And they can, we can gift them a settlement if we need to, help them as a buffer against the Norskans up here, or use them as a launching point into the enemy. Okay, so we put a leader there, no big deal. Okay, so she's gonna go. Frost Weaver. We march forth. Up here. I will permit rest. She's gonna recruit. We require soldiers. These guys. He's gonna increase his wins. A sacrifice. We're going to encircle. Yes. And then we're going to join with her. Frost maiden. Gifts of winter. Okay. Yeah, we're suffering here. Now what we're going to do is we're going to turn off this research. So the students the increase research rate, you can only get them while you're not researching. So you want to fight all your fights with this off, and then turn it on at the end of the turn. It's kind of hard to remember sometimes. So, now you can pyrrhic this, right? You're going to lose cavalry. There's no reason for us to do that. We'll go ahead and fight it. Get a much, much better result. The good news is if they put the Lord here and they're recruiting here and you kill him, then they didn't recruit at the other town. So she'll be able to hit it and Costalton will be able to come over. And that'll be them gone uh, on turn three. Now you could also hit this town on turn one with Costalton, but then she doesn't get her experience and these guys don't get their experience. It's just totally personal choice. We've got this great area here we're going to stand behind and make them walk across. And, of course, we're going to try and whittle down as many of their infantry as we can. Here we go. Look at this. This is just... And they're, they're going to walk across this shit to get to us. So that's like, okay. Now, they're ranged too, so you don't... You do not want to use a checkerboard formation because they're not going to come in and melee us. They're going to range us. So we want to be hitting them. We want to be using these guys... Here now she can uh, she can stalk up. We can actually use her up here. Maybe get a couple of hits in on them. The best thing to do would be to have her like here, so that when they start standing still to fire at us with their ranged attacks, she'll be available. Now I'm not gonna I am gonna use them. Three, 
four, five, one, two, and then she can be six. Okay. Okay, so let's start. Now they outranges. They've got 140. We are 140, and then this guy is just 130. But the good news is we can fire in every direction, as they can only fire the way they're facing. So we can hit them from the sides. Oh, this flying off in the middle of nowhere arrows. And we got to be careful if we do it. Oh, he did something to us. What happened to us? Uh, okay, speed, vigor, leadership. Yeah, that's all right. We're still way fast enough. Uh, we want to be careful not to run into any of the Cossars with the spears with our stuff here. Still pretty intent on. Uh, oh, here we go. This guy's coming back. That's fine. We want them to separate out. We want to get run away. Okay, so here they come. What's going on over here? And not in range yet. If she fires a spell here, they're just going to dodge it. So that's the thing we're not going to do. Are they still chasing us? They are. Is that guy actually going to go through the woods? He might. So what we're going to do is we're going to go this way. Leave them in the field while we come come back this way. Now, here we go. So start hitting. Okay, now she can start hitting people. We have more uh, weapons than they do, so we should be good there. Let's get these two in there. So you go hit him. You hit him. These guys, where they can start firing in at people. Get these guys out of here. Okay, let's get a lot more fire on him. It tore this guy up. Uh, no. You chase them. Can we get a bunch of dudes firing at this a-hole here? Yeah, let's get out here. 
Yeah, we want that guy dead. Come on, Streltsy, finish him off. Okay, he's gonna break. Let's run him over one time. Okay, let's get everybody lined up for the next attack. Okay, leader dead. Get out of there. Get out of there. Okay, they're going to come through that fencing. Oh, and there we go. Okay, so let's chase him down for the experience. Let's go into melee mode. Nobody else is going to be able to catch him. Now you can put these guys on melee mode, but they will still fire while they're chasing people down, which is really good. Yeah, we get a lot of kills here. Again, we don't care so much about the melee cavalry. The ranged cavalry, we do want thrashing people. Come on, get him. You can get him. Okay. Okay. So now when they take their next turn, they'll probably recruit a guy at their other city. I mean, six dudes left out of all that. That's experience. Uh, they'll be fully healed. He'll get some replenishment because we're going to be in the city. Everybody here is good and getting experience. They're getting experience. Now we have our first potential for a student since we've gone up a level. Students, once you get to five or six, they can be really good. You can also keep an eye out for Atomans to have the research trait. And it can mean the difference of one or two turns for stuff later on. Uh, you need quite a few at the beginning, because when you're researching for four turns, you need 30% to reduce that by a turn. So it really helps with the small ones, too, once you get five or six. But you need the heroes for them. Now, he's going to have the heroes, because he's going to have a crap ton of patriarchs. Well, that's nice. Okay, so we turn the research back on, upgrade these guys. Now, we this would be nice to get, so would this, but we want to turn him into a wrecking machine, so we want him to boost his, uh, his crew that he goes in with, and we want to make him tough. So we want these lines here, so we're going to move him along this line. He can get this. These guys can only get one or the other. So, okay, we want to get her into Biting Wind. Okay, now she's recruiting there. That's a separate area, so he can recruit two. Andronov can't do anything about that. Apparently we're betrayed. As soon as this is up, we're going to put it to level 2. That will open Patriarch Recruitment. Uh, it will go up and then she will add one to it. So we will actually be able to get three Patriarchs going. The snow is bomb. We don't care about this. We want to fight demons. There we go. There's the Brotherhood. Give me that. 
Stella uh, allows to do the other okay. side. So the goal again is if we can get this taken quickly enough, we can sneak up here and take this. That knocks him out of the war, and then they can fight Sarl for us. By that time, these guys will be dead because uh, Mulder will have killed the shit out of them. They'll probably put a leader in Zoyshenk. Remember, we switch this to full recruitment so she can pick up four. He picks up two, then two. So that's eight minutes we'll be able to attack with. Yeah, there's Boroda Skortskov. Otherwise known as Dead Meat. I don't think he can get there in one turn without running. But that's okay. Okay, now we've uh, encountered Mulder. He can get there, uh, yeah, he can. Gonna take, really? Oh, did they call a, uh, Motherland, they did, they did a Motherland thing, okay. So let's have her go in. Uh, in circle. Eradicate them. Supreme Patriarch. Make haste, fools. Now, if he goes into force march, the units will get there at the beginning of the fight, but they'll be tired. Um, he can just come in as a they're going to be defensive, so they're going to sit back and wait for us. So, now we got a close victory, medium casualties. We do not want close victory. We want decisive. Now the good news we have, we'll be able to get behind some terrain here. Get back in here, behind this. We'll be able to whittle them down with our cavalry to a degree. We're going to, once they are near range, use our leaders to draw fire. They won't draw much fire. They don't really draw fire. We will take the initiative. As soon as they get near range, we will put two guys on each of their archers to try and take them out more easily. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll use the cavalry really aggressively this time. Okay, so we're just going to sit here with her. I suspect they are going to just sit there. If they don't, well, that's going to be new. They should just sit there while we bring in our troops. Yeah, so we're probably going to have to approach them, and that's totally okay. We'll make a wide line because this is not an infantry fight. This is an archery fight. And uh, we'll sneak our girl up to do a little damage. They'll probably dodge it all. Okay, so... Does he have healing? He does. Okay, so one, two. She's got ah uh, three. She's got the better spells, but she is an ice witch lord. And then this lot. Let's put this all up here. Can you, yeah? Can we all get out of the way? Okay, so let's just ooch up. We want them, we want to come at them like uh, the old naval bath. We want to do our broadside here against their flank. So if we can get them to turn some of their forces this way to worry about this cav army. Okay, why don't you go around the back, but all right.
Is that everything? It looks like no, six, seven. Yeah, that's everything. So they've got the range. We don't have the research in yet, but it's coming. Here we go. Now they're uh, they're shifting, which is what we want them to do. We want them to keep archers facing this way, so they're not facing our archers over here. Streltsy slow. Yeah, the 31. So, you know, come on, Streltsy. Get with the fucking program. Maybe not a better unit money wise, but come on, they're just all around cool, right? Uh, there we go. If you hit the space bar, you can see where the enemy's range will come to. Yeah, they're going to turn to face us. That's fine. So, we're going to get like multiple units on each one of theirs and come in at the same time and overwhelm with firepower because as soon as we're in range they're gonna shoot at us now I got the Streltsy on the wrong end actually I want the Streltsy firing at someone in the open because they won't be able to fire at him twelve units here so the cavalry I don't care about, so I can do three, 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 and three. And at that time we'll send all these guys in. Where's this? Go in there. Okay, so this would be great if we were on lower levels where we can actually hit poles. Okay, where's their lines? Okay, it's quite a ways up to get to the lines. Remember, that's our line too. And we're going to want to step up and fire. Okay, time to get a little more relaxed. Okay, we'll start up here. We'll start with these three on that one. These three on that one. These three on that one. These two on that one. Okay, let's get the leaders in. Oh yeah, that should go right through there, and then into here, and then into here. Slow down any of their movement. Let's get this guy in here. Get the leaders in here. Now let's change that to to this one. Yeah, they are. Uh, not surprisingly. Damn it! What happened to the? Get out of there! Everybody here hit that guy. Love the cheer. Get the girls in here. That's a nice one. Everybody run away from the leader. 
They're still on three, that's good. Everybody run away from the leader. Magic is weak in Warhammer 3 by comparison, which is why you really, really, really need to make it count. Okay, is he the only unit left? He is, and he's breaking. So let's get let's get the leader crew together. He's about to, there we go, that should do it. You can get him before he gets off the map. Hit him one more time. Come on. No. Oh, we got him. <laughs> okay, we got him. <clears throat> okay, now she's the one who led that, so she's going to get the most experience. You can finagle it another way. You can maybe use a movement bug to get Costelton up there. Who knows? But we got in there, and we didn't turn off our uh, research. But then we're not getting a lot of experience in the secondary army anyway. We'll see. It's it, well, we need a, a mod that turns off your research at the beginning of every turn and turns it on at the end. That would be gorgeous. I'd love a mod like that. So killing these guys off at the beginning is not about being able to, because you're going to be able to. It is, of course, about how quickly and with how little losses you can do it. Uh, she did go up. Okay. Okay, they're dead. So now we want to turn off this and put that back on here. Can, ah, we can get some of these guys while we're here. Weaver of the Frosts. Now, what we got? 15. It is my duty. 19. So we've yeah, we can get some more units. Let's get a couple I of these. It's going to put us in the red. But what we'll probably do is take him out and put one of them in. This is what we want, this healing for our single entity, so they can go straight into... Let's just do... Hailstorm, one less. Does it cost eight? So it'll cost seven. Yeah, this is what we're looking for here. Bride of the Ice. We want her to... She's not really an army leader. So we want her to be able to do this and do this. So we want her this, so we want to upgrade this one. A wondrous tool indeed. Okay, so we should have an Ataman now. Uh, let's see, this is going to be control and growth. That's really good. Money's not so good at the beginning. We can move them around growth, control and growth. We want this to grow, so control and growth. You want to click the one you want and then click where it is. And yeah, and you can move them around at will. Okay, so that's going to help there. Ah, here we go. So we can get rid of that. We can get rid of that there. Okay, can't get anything. Uh, she's already recruiting him. He doesn't have any beneficial recruit look he's 450 and 118 
I don't think she's better. Forfeit, it doesn't matter. And what we're going to do is we're going to sneak up into here. Hopefully he's fighting over here. Military presence. We want him to go over there. That's what we're hoping he's going to do. Let's get control in there. We'll keep that for a turn. Yes. Yeah, I want peace with all these guys. Yes. Insulted you by accepting your offer of a trade deal? Okay, whatever. Okay, so hopefully this is where this guy goes over to attack him. He did. Look, he's gone. He went over there. So we'll go up. Don't believe we can get there in one turn. Can't. So. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into ambush mode. Is there anywhere we can really go? Eh. He's got nothing there, yeah. She will go up there. Okay. My natural environment. Are you of a high standard? We could go ahead and get a little extra strength, but she'd have she'd be seen there if we did that. The Tower of Crack has got nothing. Even if he recruits, he's not recruiting. We'll be able to kick the shit out of what's in there, and then he's going to come screaming back at us. We don't want him coming screaming back now. So we've got enough to take it. We want her for her abilities. Okay, now we can get rid of that. Now we can use this. We've got income. So the choice here is for the trade, the flat out income, 400. That gets its money back. It's, that's just too much money not to take. So we've got this coming in. We're going to fill these two guys. When they grow, we're going to replace that with another. So she's, oh, she's doing terribly. She got nothing last turn. Sometimes she'll cast some kind of devotion invocation and she'll be way ahead at this point. Well, I don't know what she's doing. My power okay. We should get that research over the end turn, which will increase our archery strength. Yay. We just don't want Azazel coming back east. Then we can hit him at crack. We will have... He came out of ambush. Azazel did not come back. He's probably over here. Effing with these guys. I didn't take a look at his strength. Yeah, that's okay. Okay, now we're going to attack without... Okay, good, they're on their way up. we got to get them now. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we can kill the shit out of that. He got units. Okay, well, we're going to get told we can't win this, but we're going to go for it. So we're going to go in magic mode. We're no way going to be able to use all that magic, but what the hell. Okay, so he's at war with... The Brotherhood, so we'll ask the Brotherhood to pay us to help them out. You are fortunate indeed to gain my attention. That gets us 1800. That gets us 1600. And 
Military access, yeah, we'll take that. You pay the proper... Okay, so this one, we want to win this with as little casualties as possible because his easel's coming right back. He shouldn't be able to make it all the way back. It's really tough to move around in here. So let's get Costaltin, where is he? Okay, now it's not even a walled settlement, it's a minor settlement. Pyrrhic victory, there, that's fine. Oh, look, they're stealing one of our fucking Streltsy. God damn it. The infidels die. That's some bullshit. Well, we want to we try and win this without killing the Streltsy. The the we want her here. Is she not? She is. Minute 57. Okay, so try not to kill the Streltsy. Now we want to get into a fight with our uh, heroes. I have no idea how good of a leader that is. We've got plenty of good cavalry. They've got a bunch of crap units. These are probably really good. I don't know shit about demons. I don't play those factions. I don't like that side of the game, but you know, what are you can do? I don't like Skaven either, but they're all over the game, so. Okay. Oh, we love this. All right. So we're going to go up here so we can fire down into all their shit. Okay, so. Oh, they didn't steal it. Okay, so someone explained that to me. They were stealing the Streltsy, and it didn't get stolen. Anybody uh, knows why that was the case? Can put something about that in the comments? I would really appreciate that. I'll take them not stealing my Streltsy. So there's a front line. Streltsy armored they're not anti-large. Not that on the ins not the anti-large guys on the outside. Here we go. So uh, I'll put them back a little. Want the Streltsy to get that first fire in, and then we'll run up with those guys if they have to. Now these guys are going to be uh, going to move as needed to the flanks. Probably just put one in the flank here. Put one in the flank there. The motherland. Can we have the stereotypical accents, please? This two. She can stalk, but she doesn't really have. She does have that. If they stand still, she can fuck them up. Could put her in here. Oh, we can. Let's see if they'll stand still. Is she on a horse? No, she's not on a horse. Okay, so these guys will hide. We are going to hide in the forest. Can that not hide? It's fucking huge bears now. Okay. Okay, yeah, we're going to back this shit up against the back side here. Just want to be up against there. Yeah. Are they going to just stand? They pop up now. It looks like they're coming forwards. Uh, let's have her coming up here. That's okay. Again, this fight will be over by then. Okay. Well, then she needs to get the fuck back here. Because really fast shit is coming. And we need to be ready for that. Okay. 
What is that? Marauder Horseman. Yeah, she needs to get the fuck back. I am the squall. She is the squall. March for Islam. Lord of Ice. Okay, they've both got their buffs and their heels. They want to come around the side. We want to be ready for that. Okay, let's make them think twice about that. Okay, they're already coming. Yeah, that slowed them down. That guy's shredded. Yeah, here we go. Okay, so she needs to be ready to put one into those guys. Is all this artillery ready to go? It is. Let's get it down here. Sorry, cavalry. Whoa, girl. Oh, that looked okay. Not great, but okay. Okay, nobody should be facing the other way anymore. Oh, she needs to get the fuck out of there. I got the wrong leader in there. Get her the fuck out of there. That was nasty. How is this guy? You start banging into the back of people. That's nice. Oh, let's get all this away from him. Okay, somebody's getting bang hammered. Yeah, this is about over. Okay, so let's everybody here hit that, except you. You stay there. In fact, you get the hell out of there. Get him out of there. There, he's going. There we go. Okay, so everybody off guard mode. Everybody kill shit. Yeah, we did. We used the winds against you. How about that? Okay. Yeah, the fight was over before she even got here. Oh, actually. These guys need to... Do a little heal rama. Mind you can get one more of these. There goes the enemy leader. Ah, bugger. Okay. So now what's going to happen is Azazel's going to go, oh shit, and come running home. And yes. My beautiful mole. <laughs> okay.
All right. So hopefully we get a couple of levels here, and that means a couple of students, if we're lucky. It seems like whenever I get them, everybody gets one. So it's like the chance that everybody gets one instead of an individual chance. But so what do we lose? 37 in that guy and that guy, it looks like. The front row, that's fine. That's what they're there for. Spell shield, that's garbage, but okay. Occupy that. Devotion from fighting chaos. Okay. Yeah. Which we don't want one of those students. Ah, damn it. Tollkeeper, that's a nice one. That is a nice one. Uh, income for buildings, that's probably only, yeah, it's only leaders. Well, no students. Let's see what, uh, so we get the lullaby. This is good too. Look at this, 40, 40 melee attack for 25 seconds. So that's great when his, uh, when his group goes into battle. So let's take that one. He can start uh, healing troops better. Okay, now that we've got that, this, while she's casting, slows everybody down. And it's the infinite, so what it will allow her to do is, even if she can't hit anybody with these, that slows all the enemies down. So it's kind of like her version of that, um, well, same thing that the ice ones have, the here, ice sheet. This is 25 for uh, 17 seconds, right? This here, okay, as long as she's casting, 12 seconds. So this is longer. Yeah, speed and charge speed, okay. Uh, she got a level, so let's get, let's get that. Because they stack. Tower of butt crack. I'm not going to put anything into this. Oh, now Zazel is out here somewhere. Let's get a couple of extra troops in here. I doubt he can recruit anything in one turn. He can't. Now we could also recruit something here and then race it up here if we need it. So that's what we're going to do. We do have another Patriarch leader down here. Here she is. That will also add to the number of Patriarchs we can get. Okay, so we... She's gonna grab two guys. No, we can't get any yet. Okay, so this is gonna pick up... This. And then we're going to upgrade that one. No, we won't have the money next turn. Yeah, we will. We'll be fine. We'll sell shit if we have to. Because we're going to get in a fight with Azazel. But we just want those four extra infantry. Getting its Azel out of the game is going to be really, really, really important. Uh, okay, so it's time for this stuff. We in turn four? Turn five, okay. Number one, get Azazel off our ass. Then we can make leisurely decisions. Okay. Here we go. Come on, Azazel. Come see us. He's going to be pissed. He's going to come running back. If he doesn't, uh, we're going to have to go look for him. Uh oh. So he blew them up. I've never seen him do that before. Shit.
Now we're going to be in money trouble. Well, we'll figure it out. We'll, we'll cancel people if we have to. Is that him or does it just look like him? Okay, that's the sorrel. Shit. Shit. Well, that sucks. Now, he might be somewhere down here, so we can send... Where the hell is this asshole? There he is. So he can get to here. So let's go... Oof. Let's go into ambush. Uh, you know, I don't have to go into ambush. He's going to have to. Yeah, we're going to give him a temptation. Let's get her. He can get to there. Okay, so we put her. Sister of ice. He needs to be able to get her. Overcome your exhaustion. He can get to those trees. For the ice court. This suffices. Seek out you get back in there. Warm your hearts with Urson's breath. Seeking Can he get there? You are not he can't. Okay. As I. He can't use all this money. She can't get there. I have no okay, so let's get her up the there anyway. March. There is no alternative. Follow the path. We got an atom and decision to make. Oh yeah. Well, let's save this uh, eighty. Okay, so who's got points? Ivana. Let's get some more items, maybe. Okay, he's he's not taking attrition there. That's an interesting spot. Okay, now we're hoping and praying that this dumbass comes for us. He shouldn't be able to resist her. He should not be able to resist her. What? Yes. And if I get the opportunity to wipe this dumbass out. With an instant auto complete, that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, let's go. Cross your fingers. Cross fingers, ladies and gentlemen of the jury. Come on, you dumb fat bastard. Come on, walk right into it. He's walking right into it. Oh, oh, oh it failed. That's okay, we should be able to win this one. Now, it looks like they were stealing. We did have a ritual enforcer. Oh, he's beat up. <sighs> he's really beaten up from taking on those enemies. So, was it that? Yeah, we should be out of things. It's easy enough. So, we want him to come running at us. We've got some good shit, and we can set up right in here. Is this one of the steep, steep, steep mountain things? All right, let's get this fight done. We've got to be somewhere else. Okay, so 
We could try and piecemeal them. If we could try and get rid of these guys first. Let's get this cavalry up here. They don't have any ranged in there. They got a sorcerer, shippers. This is a great map for us because it's wide open for our uh, ranged troops. Sons of who? Wish we had more of these guys. Should better build in this turn though. The one, two. Okay, so that's gonna be four, five. No, you're six. Okay, so we want to. Smack down these guys first. What are they doing? Not much. And then we want to lure these guys over into our archery and shoot the living shit out of them. Get this guy to to go manticore on us. Oh, those doggies. The manticore is taking a beating, but he's not cast a spell on somebody. Oh, they are way far away. Where are we going to start firing? I hate this because I can't see where the fucking archery lines are. There we go. Oh, the Streltsy opened up. Okay. Okay, there's the first of their new set of units. Where's the rest of them? Here they come. Okay, here comes Dumbass himself. We want that sorcerer fucking toast. Ow! I want that fucking guy dead. Okay, he's toast. Okay, can we, uh... idiots how to be a dumbass okay you two just start firing in there I need you to come slow them all down Lundy want you to put this on them Let's 
Somebody hit that and that and that and that. I want you to hit that. This is what we call a man's laughter. Wait. Hit them with this one. You guys get over there. Okay. Everybody off guard mode. Yeah, let's kill the shit out of that, because these guys are going to die, so we need them. We need the experience from them. Slow down. Alright. Get all these guys together. Okay, only 11 units lost, so let's call it a Pyrrhic victory for them because bullshit uh, lots of nice kills here these guys fucked some people up she got some kills now we didn't get uh, student of possibility these guys could recruit a little bit retreat but it's an ambush so if they have anybody, they'll have barely any troops left. But that should be a Zazel toast. All right. Oh, that would be nice. Let's take the money though. That guy is no problem. Okay, so we're going to end that there. Uh, that's uh, seven turns. Could eliminate him on this turn. Yeah, he can't be... Uh, he's not backed up by that, so you can eliminate his Azel right here. This guy is just nothing but crap. You'll be able to kick the shit out of him with these guys. So we're going to leave that there. Uh, anybody who'd like a copy of this save file... Uh, just uh, send me a, a DM or send a comment uh, in the video and uh, I'll give you a link to a Google Drive where you can download that. This is vanilla. There are no mods added to it. It's 2.2.1 and that is how to get rid of a Zazel by turn 7 for uh, Gostelton. It's too bad he got rid of these guys. It, was not, it would have been nice if they were still there. We're going to have to fight here now but you know, we were going to have to fight these guys anyway. Okay, thanks for watching.